patrons. 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 It's the time for patrons. Hello, patrons. Patrons. Oh, it's stream time. You know what that means. Olive's here. That Meow. means it's time for the patrons. It means it's time for the patrons. My name is Jathan. Jathan Statham. <laughs> <laughs> it's me. Jathan it's me, Statham. Jathan Statham here for the... I'm the trans Statham. For the patrons. For the patrons. <laughs> Patron Statham. Yeah. Patron. <laughs> Nathan Statham. <laughs> Hi, everybody. Uh, we got pa Pathan, Patron Statham here. Oh, my God. Pathan Statham is in the room? Pathan Statham is in the room. Whoa. A special guest. <laughs> Pathan Statham. Whoa. Um, we're doing a Patreon bonus stream. It's early this month because yeah. of Seattle trip. Yeah. Yar. Yar. That really snuck up on me personally. So. Yep. Yeah, I'm me too. Still reeling from the information that it's next week. Yep. I know. That's, that's why I put <laughs> so crazy. many reminders in our Discord of like, hey, just a reminder, we're leaving Tuesday. <laughs> and sure enough. And sure yeah. enough, we're leaving Tuesday. I yeah. thought you were joking. No. Nah. Yeah, I thought that was a bit that you just wouldn't let go. <laughs> like, wow, Julia really thinks this bit is funny where she says we're leaving Tuesday. <laughs> uh, we forgot to get uh, a plane ticket for the producers. Damn. They might not get to come. <gasps> but they have to. They're in charge of the channel. She's getting paid <laughs> right now. She's getting paid in pets. <laughs> We're on our own for this one. <laughs> oh, no. Chaos. <laughs> Chaos and I might not sound stuffy for the first time. Whoa. Wouldn't that be nice? <laughs> well someone would just clean the mics. <laughs> I do I did clean the mics not too long ago. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Julia's mic is dirtier than my mic, and I think that says a lot about Whoa, whoa, whoa. Society. Because the girls sleep like right there, so they can I look think at if you. you look at society based on oh this information, God. you'll see some some trends. Is Nathan drawing Jace, Jason, Jace, Jason, Stadium, Jason, Stadium, Jason, Stadium, Jason, Stadium, Jason. Stadium Jason. Yeah. <laughs> Are you drawing Stadium, Jason? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Well, don't be, right. be sure not to tell us any <laughs> more about it. We won't. Yeah. Be, we won't interrupt you. <laughs> yes, and <laughs> yeah. Here you can see. We got a yes, but no and. Oh, there he is. Here he is. He's so serious. Peak comedy is saying yes and then doing Period. nothing else. <laughs> yeah. I dropped a cookie on well, That's usually... basically what I do. Yeah. 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 Wow. Yeah. 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 There he is. He's ready to. He's ready to transport all your uh, Stathams. Not Thank you. I like that, Nathan, if you look at the bottom right of your screen at history, it just says pen, pen, Eero pen. I want to chant it. Pen, pen, Eero pen. Pen, pen, Eero pen. Pen, pen, Eero pen. Eero pen, pen, pen. The only <laughs> history so you insane. need. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, uh, so this... anyway, this is, this is my... He kind of looks... He looks a little sheepish. Yeah, he looks really like ashamed of something yeah. he did. <laughs> He's like, mm. I'm sorry to inform all of you, you're leaving this Tuesday. That's four days. This is the face I make when I say something awful and then someone challenges me on it. And I'm trying to pretend like they're in the wrong. <laughs> Do you, do you remember that picture of like, it was like a picture and a story of like a, a little boy who had been like peeing in his drawer in his bedroom or something. It was like on the internet a while back, but there was this picture and this mom said that she, she didn't realize that in the middle of the night, her son had been getting up and just peeing in his bottom drawer instead of going to the bathroom. And she just had no idea until she opened the drawer and it was just like oh. completely full of piss. <laughs> That's the 
the and, worst. And there's and then a she photo. She told everyone on the internet. She told everyone it. on the internet. It there's might a, as well at that point. So it's a picture of like a drawer full of piss, and this kid just like looking up at the camera with like the saddest look. And that kid, and that kid grew up to be Jason Statham. Yeah, this is Jason <laughs> Statham's Jason, piss drawer. Oh my face. god! Yeah, it basically is that boy. Why is he dressed like Batman? Oh yeah, the boys also dress like Batman. Because, oh, okay. because, because <laughs> that's what heroes do. Yeah, they piss in in whatever furniture is nearest. They don't have time to go use the bathroom. They're fighting. I crime guess at too least much. it wasn't the bed. Yeah, that's true. That's what, that's what he's saying. To replace. Yeah, <laughs> you should be thanking me for pissing <laughs> in this drawer. <laughs> I could have done so much worse. But I didn't. You're Mother. welcome. <laughs> but now I'll show you what I'm capable of. <laughs> I'm gonna piss in places you've never expected. A plus. Oh no. Oh. <laughs> A plus. Least it wasn't the <laughs> That's when you grade where Jason Statham is pissed. A plus. Least it wasn't the bed. <laughs> A plus work, Stathan's Jason. <laughs> yeah. 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 What the heck was that? I'm eating cookie. <laughs> Don't cookie. look at me. Don't look at me. Don't listen to me dropping everything. It's rude. <laughs> Stumbling around eating cookies. <laughs> slamming into things. Anyways. I'd like to imagine that A plus least is a, is a test score. It's like you get like A plus, least. but like just barely. It's like the lowest A plus you can get. Yeah. As yeah. opposed to A plus most, which is really up there. That's like 99 or 100. Yeah. Yeah. And welcome a to welcome patrons. <laughs> welcome yeah. patrons. Are it's you a, another month kind of? Yeah, this is the premium content this we is, have to offer. This we is our thank you stream this. to you. Our patrons. Do you ever think about how our Patreon oh. premium stream is sort of just like a worse version? Oh, yeah. I think that every day. I never normal... wanted to say it out loud. I mean, it's like, just occurring to me. It's just sort of like worse. It's a better version. In It's intimate. Yeah, it's a more intimate version. This is yeah. just a more... Um, how, how you, this is what we're like. <laughs> it's like you're paying to get more. I'm definitely not as on than on a Monday stream. Where it's like, like the middle of the day. Yeah. It's just hanging out. You just yeah. get to hang out with us. It's Karina like eats hanging cookies. out with us. Yeah. We Here. hang out. I got, I was, I went to Sunrise Mart and I got these cookies that have the little chocolate filling and then oh. some of them have coffee filling. And Ooh. I think they're my new favorite. That sounds delicious. Yeah, they also don't melt fucking everywhere like the chocolate digestive biscuits I usually get. So that's a mm. fun, that's a fun upside. <laughs> Low melting point on those boys. Yeah, incredibly, but they're good. Yeah. Kind of got some of that EL fudge vibes. Mm. Don't they got the ones with the chocolate in them like that kind of? There's some kind of cookie with the chocolate in them like that. I think There's... those freaking elves make them. Yeah, the elves for sure make Those them. stupid elves. Yeah, that live in the tree and make cookies. Those goddamn elves. Just little tree capitalists. Just making. <laughs> Not a drawfy stream without a siren. You're lucky if you get anything without a siren nowadays. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Also, both of our windows are open. It's the first day in like a month that we've been able to open our windows. It's yeah. nice out. It's, it's yeah. nice out. I put my two plants on outside so they could nice. get the nice weather. I would have my windows open, but I think someone was smoking because I started to smell Ugh. smoke. So, what was it? Cigarette smoke, smoke or was it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Reefer smoke. I or mean, was it like a fire pit? Usually, the latter comes from within <laughs> the apartment <laughs> down the hall. <laughs> oh. so comes then from I would within open. my yeah, own apartment, <laughs> and it's me. <laughs> <laughs> no, I've never smoked a drug. <laughs> Only eaten it. Only eaten them. It's nice. It's nice out. 
And I haven't done that in a while because it really, uh, it's hard to schedule that in. <laughs> I need to make a quick note about Nathan's very good Jason Statham Batman mug. Uh huh. <laughs> the eyes look like a plane is coming at you. Like a plane that's coming at you? Yeah, like the that's so the, the, the eyeballs, <laughs> like like the iris and cornea look like the engines of the plane. Oh. And like the eyebrows are like the wings. Yeah. And then like the tail is all the way in the back there. And then sure. And like the, is, the little nose bridge is the you front see of the it, plane. Right? Yeah. Yeah. This is the mugs like um, camouflage uh, defense thing that moths do where they have the eyes on the wings. But with the mug, it's a plane. So that yeah. you think a plane is going to crash into you if you approach it. Yeah, yeah. you dodge out of the way instinctively. Yeah. yeah. Like this. Yeah, like that. Exactly. Like that. All humans have an instinctive fear of planes because they're the apex predator. Yeah. Yeah. I've yeah. been eaten by planes many a times. Yeah. That's what the movie Prey is about. Yeah. It's about planes. I would love to watch a movie where planes were like... <laughs> Predators scouring the skies, attacking people. Well, I mean, the, didn't they make a plane the, spin off of cars? Yeah, but they don't attack people in that, presumably, because there's no people. Well, the prequel to that, where they. Yeah, they why do you over. think there's no people? Because there's that movie about the, the trucks, right? Oh, yeah. Yeah. And it, it ends, spoilers, it ends with it turns out helicopters are, are also doing it. Yeah, that's a good point. The Stephen oh my God, King I totally forgot movie. about that. Yeah. <laughs> the one that's not the good one, where like all the machines come to life. Right. What's that one called? Like hardwired or haywire or ha hard boiled or. What? It's music <laughs> blasting. Well, we can't hear it. Uh, Just trust us. <laughs> <laughs> Maximum, Maximum overdrive. overdrive. Yeah, that's the good one. <laughs> And then the other one is, I believe it was just called Trucks. Yeah, was I, do, it just called I trucks? do think it was just called Trucks. Like Jaws. I think it was like Trucks with an exclamation point. Oh. <laughs> trucks. Whoa. You're, you're looking it up. We need to get something for Nathan to draw. We've just yeah, been like chatting. Nathan's suffering. <laughs> I'm having it's a great a time. 1997 movie Trucks. Yeah, just Trucks. Uh, it has three. It has a rating of three point eight out of ten, which I think is generous. Yeah, that's pretty generous. <laughs> oh, that's right. We watched it because the poster for it is amazing. It's a skeleton behind the wheel of uh, like an eighteen wheeler, and it's like act, It's like it's got that motion blur, and it says, "You turn, you die," and it's spelled <laughs> like with the U, like a yeah. U turn, and then a U die. Elephant poke, like in Cars. But if you thought you were going to get a skeleton behind the wheel, you're wrong. Bram Stoker's Tom and Jerry. What does that even mean? <laughs> new Pokemon from the teaser trailer? You seen those new Pokemon? There's that dog that's like a damn oh, cookie the, yeah, or something. The, the bread dog. Yeah, bread dog. Uh, bread dog? Land there whale. There is a bread dog. Ice. I just want to see Spigatito's final evolution. It's, it's going to be like, it's going to be bad compared to what you made. I know. Oh. Fido. Fido. Bread dog. Bread dog. Fido. Fico. Credit score. I'll draw bread dog. I leave my phone He's making this bathroom. face. He's going like What? He's going <laughs> like, "Huh? What are you talking about?" <laughs> bread? Yeah, sure. I got yeah, bread. Take a bite. I got it. Yeah, I don't know. Whatever. Take a bite if you want to be fucking dead. I you want to know my hot take? I don't have any feelings about Fido. The bread it's dog? Pretty, it's pretty whatever to me. Yeah, I don't think it's the best. Nah. It literally just looks like <laughs> a pastry <laughs> with a with a goofy face on it. It really does just look like, you know, when they when they put like the cakes on display at the bakery and they kind of all look a little weird. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I wish they had made Fido like one of those sort of like fucked up 
attempts at turning a cake into a dog. <laughs> yeah, one of those cake like, dude, am I a dog? <laughs> yeah, where it's like, like the eyes are kind of melting off oh, a little I bit, I and it. it's sort of like yeah. janky. Yeah. That's kind of what I'm drawing. So. It should be one of those pogies that has a fucked up second form. Like, what's the penguin one with the ice cube head where you attack it and it just has, like, yeah. the tiniest little stupid baby head? Nathan, where... I have to say this really quickly <laughs> before you move on. This looks like chibi Homer Simpson. <laughs> Don't. <laughs> Don't. <whoa. laughs> Complete this. Complete this. Complete this. <laughs> it's like a Muppet Baby's version. <laughs> Precious moment. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, it's so good. Doe, what's this boy? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Oh my uh, god. I work at the power plant. <laughs> <laughs> I like donuts. Marge. Marge. Help. <laughs> oh, help! <laughs> the thing he's always saying. Oh, help. <laughs> I'm too favorite, small. Famous catch. <laughs> help! Uh, Lord. <laughs> <laughs> help him! Oh my God! He's begging. <laughs> this is unbelievable. Oh, Lord. <laughs> Why is it so funny to look at? It's really good because it's very accurate and very funny. <laughs> uh, now this stream is worth the Patreon money. Yeah, we've done it. We brought it around. <laughs> you you paid to have this laugh. This laugh is what we are able to give yeah. you. This is a premium laugh. Yeah, high quality laugh. <laughs> Members only laugh. <laughs> That's right. Oh, I'm going yeah. to uh, Mo's to get some beer. <laughs> I also apologize for interrupting you, Karina, to say that, but it felt very cr I crucial to I don't me. even remember what I was talking about. I think that was more important. What was I talking about? You were talking about the penguin with the ice cube on his head. <laughs> That's it. I was just going to say that with Fido, it should be like if you use a fire move on it, it gets all melty and fucked up. Yeah, I would love that. <laughs> it gets like yeah. brulee. Yeah, and it like excretes all of its yeast. <laughs> <laughs> Special ability yeast excretion. <laughs> yeah, and it's going to be one of those like... Um, uh, competitive strats where it's like you idiot you fool <laughs> you've excreted the yeast <laughs> you've already lost once the yeast is excreted it's over <laughs> yeah <laughs> taking down stupid legendary spammer with one yeast excretion sweep <laughs> 10 million views on youtube <laughs> What's what's this you're doing, Nathan? This is the whale. Is yeah. this the whale? It's the whale, but whale. But since we're doing Simpsons, oh. it's Lisa. Oh my is god! The whale, Lisa. The, yeah, and that's why he's saying help. <laughs> help. The whale is Lisa. The whale is Lisa. We have to stop it. Lisa's rebelling. <laughs> Oh my god. I can't stop looking at I want a <laughs> sticker of this chibi Homer and I will put it on the back of my phone. I want this one to be like the like the the what is it, the rainbow shiny finish Karina that you had on the <laughs> holographic Hanzo field. Uh yeah. which one? I did two <laughs> runs of that one with different finishes. I did holographic and then I just went a little crazy one time and did prismatic and that one is like awful to look at. <laughs> <laughs> it harms you. It kind of does because that's the one where it has like the square patterning. Oh. So it like has just a lot of layers to it and it 
you, you you shine one direct light on that and that's it for the day you gotta go oh, lay down yeah that's a lot <laughs> that's a lot huh i was oh, like yeah those are crazy yeah i was like ha, this would be great to do a full finish for something <laughs> let's do it <laughs> yeah it's hard to decipher what is in this yeah sticker i'm looking at yeah it's like a good it's... it's a good finish for if you just really want attention yeah, or for like a cursed <laughs> drawing like that. Yeah. Like obscuring it a little bit makes yeah. it even more cursed. I, I was trying to help. <laughs> Someone did a beautiful anime boy that has a partial prismatic sticker like around him. Oh, yeah. Oh, I have that's some really like pretty that. actually. Yeah, yeah, it looks really good when you do it like that. If you put it on the design, you have to be really careful. <laughs> yeah, I like that. <laughs> yeah. I, like I wonder this if it's too. the artist I'm thinking of because oh they've made God. a bunch. <laughs> oh my God, she's, she's coming. Is she's she, like T-Pose running. Is yeah. she like about to eliminate Homer? <laughs> well, yeah, that's, that's why the, he's saying help. It's a very different energy from Naruto running where you're doing it behind you to be aerodynamic. You're doing it to the side to be as... <laughs> <laughs> like unaerodynamic as possible. Yeah, you want to make like the sound of the wind whipping over your arms audible <laughs> as a threat. Oh my god, Joe and Skate the Infinity should do that. Instead of planking on the board, he like lifts himself up and does the splits. <laughs> <laughs> Slows way down. Yeah. <laughs> wow, that could be a good like season two strat. He's going way too fast and he needs to slow down in an instant. Boom. He needs to do a tight turn. That way he can lean more of his body over. <laughs> tell Jonah. Jonah, you can do this, right? <laughs> Jonah, tell them what the, what they have to do. Yeah. Uh, Nathan, you did is, a spectacular job. This is the new Pokemon game. It's the Simpsons, it turns out. <laughs> Good. Finally. Well, now in the thumbnail, you can do uh, uh, the the Fido. You can do a picture of Fido, and you can do a picture of Homer Simpson, and you can do a plus. I'm not going to remember that. Fair. Maybe. Yeah. But maybe. The, the thumbnail is can only be just this Homer's face saying help within, like, <laughs> blank space out to the left yeah. of it. Maybe, like, the full body, I but I mean, y'all y'all haven't that. even drawn I'm yet. not, I, Nathan. That's a, lot, that's, that's a lot of confidence that my drawing Nathan? is the most clickable thing we... Nathan? Yeah. I'm not drawing anything better than this. I just yeah. right. I've already made that's up a, my mind. That's a cold yeah. shot. All right. Yeah. If it starts to feel a little too good, I'm going to delete it. <laughs> okay. Karina's going to throw her arms out and, and yeah. stop her momentum. <laughs> Right. Like in Skate the Infinity. <laughs> Season two. <laughs> Season two, confirmed. <laughs> uh, oh, who's, who's next drawing? Karina? I'll do it. Cookie Karina? Big truck time. Almost clicked leave again. Okay, Nathan. What? Are you paying attention? Am I paying? I said I'd teach you how to do this. You see how the, the layer's called paper? Yeah. You double click it, and then you change the color, and it changes the color. <laughs> Do you understand this? <laughs> I can hear Karina's voice, but I don't know where it's coming from. Sorry, I was chewing. <laughs> I know. <laughs> do you could need me to do it again? Uh, yeah, could you do it one more time? Yeah. So you see over here on the layers <laughs> where it says yeah. paper, yeah. you double click it you, and then okay. you can change it, any color, boom. And then it changes the background. Do you get it? it you don't need you. to clap, it wasn't magic. You don't draw need class to is over. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for joining us on the, today's draw class. Do you get it never, now? I was never made to clap. <laughs> <laughs> do you get it? <laughs> do you need me to do it again? <laughs> I don't need you to do it again, but if you want to do it again, you can. <laughs> okay, what should I draw? More William Annius? I was probably going to do that. I was going to draw a Will slash Philanius self-cessed, but not on stream. 
That's for your private time. Yeah, that's for the weekend. That's, that's a weekend for Tumblr. Drawing. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Follow me on Tumblr. I do still post there. It's really good for archiving. <laughs> Demon voiced Padamon. That already exists. Did you see the video I posted yesterday of the Digimon game? I didn't get to listen to it, so I didn't get the, <laughs> the stuff out of it. Just I the noises the that Padamon makes. <laughs> I'm going to go back and listen. Just listen to it right now. Because Digimon just talk, right? Yeah. They just they just have full yeah. full brains that can do <laughs> language. Scrooge McDuck vampire hunter. That sounds fun. Oh fuck! I don't have my phone. I'll just have to guess what a vamp. Oh wait, I don't know what Scrooge McDuck looks like. Okay. All right, Good. everybody, be quiet. I'm gonna play the sound. Okay. okay. Into the microphone. <laughs> are you okay also zoom hated that totally yeah, cut that audio it sounds kind of like <laughs> i bet they heard it on the stream yeah. though okay yeah okay that's good yeah it it sounds weird <laughs> No. Okay. Uh, <laughs> it's just because, okay, like, the yeah. The stream they... heard it. Good. Okay, perfect. So everyone's heard it but me. Yeah. Because Digimon talk, but in when you do, like, these little talking things or half of the battles, they do just have, like, weird stock, uh, like, noises that they make. Godomon literally just has like cat meows. It's so funny. <laughs> like like you defeat Godomon, it goes. <laughs> like, like you don't have to do that, <laughs> ma'am. You have a whole human voice <laughs> and a full vocabulary. Yeah. Okay, it's another day, another drawing. Scrooge McDuck. Scrooge this was Scrooge McDuck Vampire Hunter. Is that what yeah. I heard? Yeah. Yeah. Damn. It sounds fun. It yeah. sounds fun. I want to have fun. Let's have fun. <laughs> I haven't drawn anything in several days. Wow. Because I've been working on editing. Oh. So I got to remember sense. how to draw today. You did a great job editing. Thank you, Nathan. <laughs> I want you Welcome. to know also that the video is cursed because when I was exporting it, it kept freezing in the last like 20 seconds mm -hmm. of the video awesome. and then and then crashing mm -hmm. Adobe Media Encoder. Is this Did it, the one that came out this week or the one that you're doing for it's next for week? It's for when we're back. <laughs> it's a speed draw. Or whenever draw. the fuck that, yeah, that one. Yeah. I don't remember when that did was it, scheduled wait, for. Wait, did it ever? Did it do yeah. it? Or? We did it on Julia's computer and then it worked. Yeah, okay. I have it. So and I then just, I, I clicked through it and it worked. We, we both had separate issues with that video. <laughs> That's great. Yeah, my issue with it was, Karina, during your drawing section, uh, that my my premiere was just like, there's nothing here. <laughs> it just went it just went to black immediately. Your drawing oh, was too hot to handle. That's That's great. I did like that drawing. It's a great drawing. Yeah. I like all the it's drawings. It's a good episode. episode. It's a good episode. I'm excited for that one. Yeah. yeah. I think people are going to really enjoy it. And also, we haven't had a speed draw in too long, and we need that speed draw traffic bump. Yeah. yeah. People love the speed draws. They just get the views. There, there's a there's a certain segment of, of our fans that only watch the speed draws, I feel like. <laughs> I mean the, it's when the numbers we're the, least goofy. <laughs> the numbers indicate that that is the case. Okay. It simply must be. Or yeah. that they just happen to draw in more outside people. Um, <laughs> uh, is that the most accessible? <laughs> yeah, yeah, because yeah, they're more accessible. <laughs> I like both types of videos that we yeah. do. Me too, because we can't get the same amount of laughs in the speed draw. We have to like kind of be on task a bit. Yeah. I forgot that the episode that just came out had my favorite me joke that I've ever said on the show. The ARG one. My ARG <laughs> joke. <laughs> the one that made you laugh for a <laughs> solid minute before you were able to say it. Yeah, did you trim that down? Uh, No, I don't think so. Oh, I think okay. That was the full... I remember maybe, laughing maybe, for a really long time. Maybe David did. I don't know. 
if they did, they did it so seamlessly that I didn't, uh, yeah. I didn't notice. I, I didn't give the note. Put all of Julia's laugh back in. <laughs> Put it back. I had completely forgotten about that joke, and people kept, you know, the comments said a lot of like Julia's bad joke, you know, just like mentioning a bad joke. And I was like, I don't even remember what I said. And someone had time stamped it, and I listened to it uh, like on my phone while we were in bed and I laughed very hard and Jacob immediately said, Oh my God. And so it just got the same reaction out of yeah. us as it did the first time. That's my, and, and when I listened back, I laughed basically the same amount I did in the, in the episode. So just laughing yeah. with yourself. Uh, That's my favorite is, is watching back an episode, hearing a joke, that I remembered liking and then laughing along with myself. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's so weird. Oh, Nathan, my brother, whenever we talk about Drawfee, my brother says that we have to just make like a compilation video of you losing it to jokes because he says every time he has a bad day, he puts on <laughs> Nathan uh, losing it to a joke and it makes him feel better. He yeah. says he says your laugh uh, cheers him up a lot. Aww. He Thanks, says we Julius should bottle it. He said that we wouldn't need medication anymore if we made this video. <laughs> like the world, like the pharmaceutical industry yeah. would go under because everyone would be healed. I think and that's someone made facts. a made a Nathan laughing <laughs> compilation video, but you know. Compilation video makers, you, you can make another one. I've laughed more since yeah. then. I bet <laughs> it'd be sad Dude, if people... you hadn't. I'm not. I'm not keeping track. I never laughed. <laughs> not, not, not like since. anyone's keeping score, but uh... do people who make the compilations know how much we enjoy them? They better. We do watch them every They're time they favorite. get suggested to me. Yeah, it, it's so nice. It's so nice to see, like someone's opinion of the best examples of the thing that I spend all my time doing. Just like in rapid succession, just like yeah. us us and our show at its best. It's like, thank you. <laughs> oh. Feels good. <laughs> yeah. yeah oh, it's, it's working. It's really nice. That's great. <laughs> and, and just the fact that like, whenever I get recommended anything from YouTube that is like of us or about us, that we didn't make, I just feel like it's the coolest thing. Yeah. I'm like yeah. somebody liked what we did enough that they spent however much time this took to just make something about it. Yeah. Yeah. As That's a crazy. Who spends a lot of time using editing programs. They're not the best to use. <laughs> so the fact that you chose to do that. Thank you. Yeah. Also, someone asked if we saw the Felix song. Yes, we saw the. Yes. We, we saw and heard yes. the Felix song. And it is stuck in my head. <laughs> Phantom sensations. <clears throat> I'm going good. to. I have to get a drink. I'm sorry. I drank all my Gatorade. It's gone. Maybe you should get a bigger cup. You mean this little sake cup isn't enough beverage? I think that might be the issue, is that. If you go in there, you have to refill my water bottle. You got it. You got Can it. Can you bud. grab my phone? I left it in the bathroom. Yeah. Ooh. Does it? Wait. I have it. It's right here. Can I borrow? Um, <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> can I borrow a, a, a charger? My phone's gonna die. Yeah. Here. Here. <laughs> Thank you. Ah. I threw it to you. <laughs> I hated that. <laughs> Put that back. I throw it at the door. <laughs> 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 I think also when I see the um the like fan compilations and fan works I think about Nathan that image from Chainsaw Man that you keep sending Oh yeah <laughs> this just saying I guess I'd rather die than work There's a character named the the Angel Devil <laughs> and there's just it's it's such a beautiful it's he's like a beautiful boy with long hair and a halo and he his whole personality is just that he's lazy 
<laughs> and, and doesn't want to work. And I love him so much. He's my favorite. And so Nathan's mood image is the I guess I'd rather die than work panel. <laughs> yeah. And so to think of people like willingly and for no like monetary gain of their own spend the time to work and make these things is an honor. It's an honor. They might Thank not you. have the same honor. mentality that me and Nathan do where the the thought of doing something extra is like <laughs> <laughs> like why would I ever why would I ever do that <laughs> extra you want me to what I already did the normal yeah why yeah, is there it's, more it's really nice I <laughs> yeah. hope I hope everyone who makes the compilations sees this and knows how much we love them yeah yeah I also like how it forces my friends to be exposed to what I do. Yeah, it's also, I think... <laughs> On like, the internet. <laughs> Even if they don't bother with it, usually. I think the compilations are a great way because I, I do see this uh, this sentiment on on Twitter sometimes where people are like, uh, none of my friends like Drafi. I wish I could talk about Drafi with them. Cause I get it. It's hard to get someone to sit down and watch like a forty-five minute YouTube video. Yeah, where we say a lot of stupid shit, but like <laughs> stupid inaccessible shit. But like a ten-minute compilation of the of the funniest stuff we've said, it definitely, you know, you get the idea. It's it's not as big of an ask. And if any yeah. one thing in there makes them laugh, then they might be like, you know what, maybe I'll. I'll put this on yeah. in the background while I'm doing something. Yeah, it's like just... how I'll never watch Riverdale, but I will experience it, like, solely through out of context uh, compilations, and I'll I'll know all I need to know. It's like the me best and way. Glee. <laughs> yeah, I will never watch Glee, but I will watch some compilations. Have also, Karina, watched... this rules. Uh -huh. I you. love the energy oh, yeah. of it. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, have you watched the one where someone did it like season by season for Glee? That's like my like comfort videos. <laughs> I've only seen like three compilation ones. <laughs> my favorite I... are the ones of um, Britney. All the Britney <laughs> one-liners really kill me. Glee was such a mess. Cause like, of course I liked Glee. I went to gay art school, but um, when you really isolate it to its like most wild one-liners it really does seem like a really funny and good show <laughs> <laughs> when you extract only the goodness yeah, yeah. <laughs> if it was just a, a bunch of one-liners and not like a show that ostensibly had like a plot and characters i was supposed to care about it's better. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my god, every truck today. Yeah, it's truck day. When the weather's nice, it's truck day. Yeah. The They're trucks like no come one out. shall enjoy. Yeah. Well, hope the well they heard us nice next week. They heard us talking about that Stephen King movie. That's true. <laughs> yeah. Like, Now's our talk... time to shine. <laughs> Y'all talk about trucks in there? Room room. <laughs> Remember Here we are. Wow, I wish <laughs> trucks were real. <laughs> oh, they're real. And Whoa. they're fabulous. Whoa. Um, I just kept thinking, Karina, when you said you went to gay art school. <laughs> what you was it gay art? Yeah. Yeah. I kept thinking of like a like a school headmaster in like the opening speech being like, Welcome to gay art school. <laughs> we hope you all enjoy your four years at this gay art academy. Yeah. I hope basically. you have a I hope you have pride in your school. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Yes, a little humor. For you. Yeah, and that headmaster was fruity little gargoyle I found on Amazon. <laughs> Can I show the gargoyle on stream? I still have it screen capped. Oh, yeah, <laughs> why, why not? Yeah, do it. <laughs> So, uh, long story short, I was uh, browsing Amazon looking at stone gargoyles, as you do on a Friday morning, and I came across this one that I'm kind of obsessed with, 
and I'll never buy it, but he's I, so coy. He's so cute. <laughs> he's so funny. <laughs> Socrates the gargoyle thinker. I'm just thinking. Love him so much. He's two hundred twenty six dollars. <laughs> <laughs> and there's how this big, like how big twenty three inch. Twenty three inches. Like so that's two like feet. two feet. Yeah. He's yeah. a little guy. He's, I mean, little guy. He's it's just king. a gargoyle. Yeah. I really <laughs> wanted his name to be Design Toscano. <laughs> <laughs> I think he has nipples. He does definitely oh, yeah. have nipples. There are yeah. so many weird looking gargoyles on I Amazon. I love weird looking gargoyles, but th his veins. His veins? Yeah, he's, but, he's vascular. Uh, there's this really funny review that I sent, the one I sent y'all, where the guy's like, I got this for my garden, and I have it sitting where uh, it's facing me where I usually like go and sit. My kids hate it. My girlfriend hates it. Everyone hates it. But if 2020 taught us anything, it's to like do the things we want to do. So go buy that <laughs> gargoyle. <laughs> it was so motivational. That's beautiful. I loved it. But yeah, that was my discovery of the day. <laughs> and I'm just going to think about him sitting there thinking <laughs> forever now. Oh my God. Design Tos Toscano also has a steampunk armor clad round bird oh, oh that's yeah. good i it's very cute i was because long story short um i'm looking for something to weigh down an outdoor rug i am hoping to simply find a brick on the sidewalk but everyone's been real stingy about that around here apparently oh my so... dad has bricks <laughs> bro can i have a brick <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll ask him. We're going to see him Brick soon. Me, yeah. I'll have him bring in a brick. If I don't acquire a, a heavy rock or a brick by then, I'll let you know. I'll you have my dad a carry a brick from Long Island. <laughs> you don't actually have to do that. but No, I mean, he'll do it. If he's willing, He'd I'll He'd take it take as it. weight training. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, so I was just looking at like little outdoor statues like just to see what was there and i love looking at weird outdoor statues because it is like the epitome of suburban damn bitch you live like this <laughs> <laughs> i saw a dabbing dragon i saw a meditating gray alien wow. people will cast anything and put it in their yard yeah why not <laughs> why not <laughs> oh my god do you oh do you guys want to buy an animatronic <laughs> dodo off of Etsy, uh, off of eBay? It's huge. How huge? It's, How huge? It's okay. Hold on. I'm opening the whole listing. Oh my god. Julia, this is very much just a you thing. No, I'm interested. Okay. How much does it cost? It's it's 1.5 meters by 1.2 meters. That means it's like That's four foot big. by four by four, <laughs> four four by like three and a half. That's huge. It's a giant dodo. Ana animatron. What does it do? What is it? Does it say stuff? Does it, it talk? It moves. It talks. It has sound effects. It's coin operated. I, mean, <laughs> I have to right. pay to use my dodo. <laughs> my own damn dodo. Oh my In god. My they make other ones. Terror bird animatronic animal. <laughs> I want a terror bird. Oh, no, wait a second. You didn't tell me they had terror bird. This one is 2.1 yeah, meters. This is, wait. <laughs> so this thing bigger. is six foot. <laughs> Yo, it's the, it's the height oh, of me. Wait, how much does it cost? Um, yeah. It's, f oh, it's on sale. Okay. Oh, okay. that's a relief. It's on sale. So I it's only, on it's only $5,470. Okay. We can expense that. We can expense that. Put <laughs> that on the company. We have to use it in one video. Yeah. Today's guest is the terror bird. Oh my God. Okay. So. <laughs> the coin operated terror bird. No, this one, uh, this one is motion sensor activated. Ooh. It opens its mouth. Uh, and when it opens its mouth, it screams. Its head moves, its neck moves up and down, and his wings flap. 
Oh my god, uh, there's a video. I would love a six foot tall screaming robotic bird. <laughs> yeah, yeah, just just to say I have $5, one. Thousand dollars. <laughs> yeah. You know what I actually want? Robotic bird. I one got of it on sale. Fucking like the what was it called? The dynamite explosion band. Uh, the uh, f- fucking precursor to Chuck E. Cheese animatronics that you can find refurbished and um, uh, programmed to sing Love in the Club. <laughs> <laughs> yes. I just want to have it to like sit in my living room with me and like, play Digimon. In the, so- in the future, when we buy the Droppy Mansion <laughs> yeah, that deal. we all live in when we're like 65 years old. Yeah, it's like a retirement home. <laughs> yeah. We're gonna Rock fill a it. a fire explosion, thank you. We're gonna fill it with all of this. Yeah. It's gonna be a horrible place to be. <laughs> yeah, it'll be very stressful and no one will like it. Not okay. even us. <laughs> Here's the thing. This the company content. makes animatronic elephants that spray water out their snouts. Ooh, elephants. Uh, it does say, here's the description. The entire animatronic attraction showed a scene of an adult elephant playing leisurely with its baby elephant. Aww. Uh, the baby elephant uh, was intimidated. This group of elephant animatronics is very suitable to be placed in parks or shopping malls, making the whole scene alive. Yeah. Okay. I go to a shopping mall normally or a park and I'm like, ugh, this scene is dead. <laughs> There's an animatronic elephant. Yeah, intimidating. Like, it's young. Now I want to. Now I want to participate in commerce. Now I'm yeah. ready to spend my money. My wallet is is loosening. It's opening All up. Sudden, when, when YouTube stops working, can we like buy a bunch of animatronics and make like a rainforest cafe esque restaurant? Yeah. But it like doesn't have a cohesive theme. It's just full of animatronics. Just a bunch that we of found. horrible shit. Yeah. Karina. Yeah. Yes. We call it, we call it the stress restaurant. <laughs> Karina, there's a dinosaur band that you can buy. <gasps> it's three of them. It's a triceratops I... or whatever the one that has like link the it, little link red me. mohawk and yeah, then a blue T Rex. Does it say if they're programmable? Um, they should be. Yeah, can I program them to sing Kill This Love by Blackpink? <laughs> if you can't, then I don't think it's worth the sticker <laughs> yeah, price. Yeah, then it's not. Then it's not. This ain't, this ain't it. <laughs> oh my god, there's another dinosaur band you can buy. They have several <laughs> dinosaur bands. Link me. Wh- which, um, which dinosaurs are playing which instrument? I, you know I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, gonna gonna check out this. The this Triceratops link. has uh like a tambo. Yeah. <laughs> okay. What are the instruments? Actually, yeah. it looks like he has just a wheel of cheese. Okay, yeah, a wheel I, of cheese. It's, it's, <laughs> yeah, it's it's the, the tambourine is implied. Then we've got sort of a T Rex on the. How many strings is that? Is that a bass or a guitar? Let's see. Unclear. Cool. It's sort, of a cool. Long, it's, it's sort of a very long. I don't know. I don't know what instruments these are. I believe are. he's got a shamisen. Okay. Oh. Yes. The, Obviously. The T Rex is playing a shamisen. The T Rex oh, is playing a shamisen, and the Paris Paris What's it? What are those ones it looks called? Looks like uh, some sort of loot. It's a weird trio of instruments. I'll tell yeah. you that much. So Wheel of cheese. Perfect for kill this love. Parasaurolophus. That's what it was called. And he's got a loot. Yeah, this is sort of a sort of a throwback. I mean, I, they didn't have as many instruments in dinosaur All right, this times. Is, I think this one's only for Julia. But now I'm just thinking of, uh, you know, like the part in Let's Kill This Love where they do the breakdown. <laughs> it's like the, the horns, but instead it's a lute. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god <laughs> <That part. laughs> i'm also excited because on this website i found a listing for what is quote couple of brachiosauruses just a couple, <laughs> just a couple of them just a couple of them <laughs> yeah they are huge they're 15 meters by seven meters hey what's the math on that <laughs> basically you can drive a truck under them 
Bruh. <laughs> be, it's just trucks. a couple of them. That'd be I'm great for the trucks. entryway to the stress to run. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> 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 We turn the volume on these things up to maximum and put them all in a restaurant, all screaming, <laughs> and yelling, and playing instruments. <laughs> you can also buy a gigantic centipede statue. Oh, for how gigantic! For four thousand three hundred seventy dollars. Um. These are all write-offs once he's, they open the restaurant. He's yeah, the three meters long. <laughs> three meters for yeah. 4,000? What a steal. I know. Yeah. And of course, the tagline for this restaurant is enjoy your meal concept. <laughs> <laughs> of course. I think we may be onto something here, gang. <laughs> oh my god, they got dragons. What? God. Julia, you have to get off this website. I can't. I'm fascinated. I, no, I can't Julia, just keep Julia... listening to you over there going, what? No way. Let Julia <laughs> enjoy the website. Let yeah. me be excited about the Parasolophus scooter dinosaur car. Yeah, hop off, Jacob. <laughs> this guy's Can't driving around. Can you see around. that there's a lot of this off of scooter car? I'm obsessed. Okay, I'm putting I'm this in the chat. <laughs> I'm done. I want to look at the this animatronics. Is, this is beautiful. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> this you. is so good. Good drawing. This is thank you, thank you. so much better than it needed or had any right to be. <laughs> and I didn't even make him shirtless. <laughs> Not this time, but his toes Not are out. Not this time. His, his toes are always out. His toesies out. are out, yeah. He Just like his has... entire bottom half. He still has his giant uh, pool of coins, but they're all silver. Yeah. Ooh, and he anyways. shoots them out of the gun. Yeah. Nice. Whoa. Oh, gotta go look at some animatronic. Oh, it's a little scooter car. <laughs> Suggestions for Jacob. Give me something to guy. draw. No, I love these silly little cars. I, I think Aww. I said once in an episode that like, I would only ever see them in malls in the Philippines, and it's true, but I guess they have them in America too. I don't know. Not at my mall. <laughs> Not in my ball. Not in my ball. If you had a cold and you said mall, it would sound like ball. Yeah. L Mint asked for Cult of the Lamb fan art. Oh yeah! Ooh, are you yeah. playing it? I'm getting it for the flight. Oh! I'm gonna be playing it on the plane, a little plane plan. Just a little bit of plane the plan. Lamb. Is that yeah. the one about the cult the of the lamb? That's the one about the yeah, cult of the lamb. The lamb with the cult. Is that the one about the little lamb that gets that? Yeah. That gets the cult. Yeah, with the cult. Oh yeah. You know the lamb yeah. that has the cult. Yeah, and he and he's got a sword. He's, he's killing all the cute little guys. Oh yeah. And it's what also you, you make a town. What are you drawing, Jacob? Is it is it for Switch? Yeah, it's for Switch. Did yeah. I get it too? Is yeah. there is there multiplayer? I don't think so. I think it's mostly a single player experience Dang. that you experience alone and in silence. Dang. Yeah. I'm also getting Cult of the <clears throat> Lamb because we watched a video about it and I was like, dang. This looks great. I guess I'm getting Cult of the Lamb. <laughs> Everyone's going to be playing Cult of the Lamb on this trip, and I'll be over here playing my stupid Digimon visual <laughs> novel. Oh, I was going to say playing Phoenix Wright for like the fifth time. I wish. I mean, I could, <laughs> I could get the Digimon game, and we'll no. be two and two. No. no. Well, I mean, I don't know. I don't know like what games people want. That's all. It's it's I, a tactics game. I just want to have fun when I play games. I find that recently every game I play just pisses me off and isn't enjoyable. And I would love to play mm. games that I enjoy playing. Why do you again. keep playing the games that piss you Ooh. off? Because uh. they're designed in such a way that uh, it tricks you into thinking maybe this time. <laughs> I saw. It's like that, uh, it's like that thing from... Uh, from Arrested Development, where it's uh, Tobias being like, maybe it'll uh, it'll work for us. Uh, yes, Karina, you saw. Uh, I mean, I haven't looked into it or played it, but that uh, Shinchan game came out 
in English, right? Oh yeah, Tristan was telling me. I didn't think that was coming to America, so I was I know, surprised. I know, I was so surprised. It just looks like a summer vacation simulator. <laughs> So maybe that's the game that won't piss you off. Yeah, I was, I was talking to Tristan because we were playing Monster Hunter the other night. And and he was like, I don't know if you if you know anything about this, but um, there's this Shin-Chan game <laughs> coming out for the Switch in America. And I was like, oh, you mean the one that was made by the same studio as Boku no Natsuyasumi? <laughs> and he was like, oh, so I guess you do know about it. <laughs> <laughs> I guess you super know about it. Yeah, I was super curious about it. I was thinking of getting it, but I mean, I'm already playing one game right now. I can't play two. That's that's hard. Um. I liked uh, I liked that vampire game we were playing for a little while. V Rising. Yeah, Verizing? I would play more of that. Yeah, I also would play more of that. Verizing. That fun. Verizon. We also still wow. haven't finished our Divinity game that we started i haven't been thinking about that yeah we've just been busy it's been it's been yeah, yeah either we've Ace. been out or you've been out nathan so we yeah haven't, I've, we haven't I've had, had, had time i've had zero weekends yeah <laughs> oh that's true you're, you're about to have your first weekend yeah congratulations thank you yeah uh someone in chat asked how my knee is my knee is uh fine Yay. <laughs> I went to the doctor yesterday because it started to hurt a lot. And my doctor didn't believe me that I dislocated my kneecap. And then I said that I uh, basically put my hand on my kneecap that was on the side of my knee and put Ugh. it back into its spot. <sighs> and he went, oh, yeah, I guess you did. Thanks, Doc. And I yeah. was like, thank you. He just had to you... get his not believing women out right at the beginning. Yeah, yeah. it's tradition. Cut, cut you off mid sentence to tell you. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, wait, like, just I... before you continue, um, I have to make sure I let you know that I don't believe what you're saying. <laughs> yeah. Um, oh, you have proof, huh? The best part about going to see the doctor was that I tried to get a hold of my primary doctor and I called her four times and she didn't pick up. So Jacob very nicely walked me to urgent care in case my knee did something bad. Mm -hmm. And we went to urgent care and they were like, oh, our x-ray tech isn't in today. You should go to this other location. So we're like, okay. So Jacob called the car and we took the car to this other place and they went, oh, our x-ray machine's broken. <laughs> <laughs> and then they were like, wow. you should go to this other location. And I was like, do they have both a tech and a working machine? <laughs> This is crucial. I have no knee. I'm begging. <laughs> I cannot ambulate. Uh, so we went over to the to the third place, and they were like, "Yeah, we're dealing with everyone who gets sent by multiple locations that are <laughs> not working." Um, but apparently, they took X-rays of my knee, and they said that it looks fine, and that I definitely wow. just. You moved it back good then. I did move yeah. it back good. So I uh I would not have the wherewithal to do that. If my <laughs> knee was on the side of my knee, I would be like I, I'm done. I think I'm done. <laughs> well Throw admittedly the whole knee. <laughs> admittedly, I did not think much about it. Um the only thing that was going through my brain was put it back, put it back, put it back, put it back. And I just I... was like panicking and squishing it back to where it needed to oh, be. God. I mean, the fact that you had the instinct to do that at all, I guess yeah. that's a step above yeah, that's more, I think that's more what Nathan's I... trying to say. Oh, yeah. yeah. Okay. I, I would have I would have just been like, I do not <laughs> yeah. touch it. I would have do... just been like, I guess it's where my knee is now. <laughs> yeah. I guess. Huh. Interesting. Huh. I, it's not where I thought it went, but it seems like it wants to be there. So Yeah. So I finally, guess this is just who I am now. <laughs> finally outgrew my old knee position <laughs> oh this is cool jacob yeah this is fun the game is super cute looking i love it i love all the animals i saw a little donkey in the video we were watching i'm obsessed with that donkey yeah it's, it's very cute i'm excited to body go where body go where body go body go under 
body goes just little yeah. leggies sticking out just leggies i think that's the answer yeah <laughs> for our seattle sleepover we must sit in one room do face mask and all play video games single player separately <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I love doing volume, that. <laughs> volume at max, so you can hear Patamon go. <laughs> Just too many sound effects all at once from from like six games being played. Oh yeah, fuck yeah. I do. One of my favorite Drawfee photos was unfortunately before Karina joined, but it was the photo that we all took when we were in uh, Austin and we were like truly just scheduled for too many things and not food. <laughs> and so we're all just laying down in one bed together looking yep. like we have a thousand yard stare. I yep. do like the photo that you took during Mocha after Saturday, <laughs> when we were just like waiting for our dinner. Oh yeah, and, and you took a selfie where we all just look the most dead, <laughs> <laughs> and the donut that my friends brought for us was still just <laughs> sitting on the table because we never had time to eat it. <laughs> yeah, that was a good day. Yeah. I had a great time. I just, I'd never been that tired after an event. Well, it was like yeah. the first one we had done in so long. Yeah. yeah. It was the first, it's like, in my mind, I had an idea about what it was like to be at Mocha Fest times in the past. And it, w it, w it wasn't like that. Oh, that's, that's incorrect. This part is what is, is black. Oh. Sorry, was I was like, just talking to myself. It was yeah. just truly. It was, we got the, they opened the doors and there was a huge line. Yep. Yeah. The entire time, which felt very good, but it was just not what I was expecting. And yeah, the, same. And then the security guy came up to us. <laughs> <laughs> the president. <laughs> the president. <laughs> you told him you had a million followers? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we told him. <laughs> we told him. Oh, we told him. Oh, we told him. <laughs> Can you tell? <laughs> uh, that was a fun time. That was great. I was exhausted, but I wouldn't change a thing. Yeah. I, I, I really I really miss doing events. It was it was really bad during 2020 cuz I was just like so like lonely and sick of being cooped up in my bedroom that I was like fantasizing about like all the horrible things I would do at like it's like to do artist alley because mm. it's it's just a lot of work. I was like what I would give to be back at Otacon 2017 when the pipes exploded. <laughs> <laughs> I would do anything to be back working that 13 hour Saturday. <laughs> Take eating, me back. Yeah, eating dinner at 1 a.m. in dead silence because we're all too tired. <laughs> at least it's not this. <laughs> I miss the thrill of it. It made me feel alive. <laughs> At least we could feel something. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna put a little uh, put a little tone on this. Put a little tone on this. Y'all mind if I put a little fun. tone on this? Put a tone on it. Put a tone on it. Put a tone. Mind if I hit it with a little just for the, just for the cape, a little cape tone. You mind? A little cape tone. Ooh come to North Carolina. I might have been in North Carolina. Do y'all have an amazement? I went to some con where I booked it so last minute I didn't even know where it was. I just went there. <laughs> I went to an improv festival at UNC one time. Does that count? Sure. I went to Asheville. I got uh, I got the, uh, the Sunshine Biscuits. Is that what it's called? Sunshine biscuits. Sunshine biscuits in the sun. Rally. Nice, Julia. Thank you. Yeah, like I don't remember where Anne Amazement was. I truly just showed up. I had some delightful Lyft drivers there and Uber drivers. One of them, me and my friends got into the back and she asked if we were going to the con and we were like, yes. And she's like, ah, oh, yeah, I love your costumes. And we were all just dressed normally. <laughs> and that was like, uh, I love that. 
<laughs> she was talking about the costume we all wear in everyday yeah. life, you know? We when all we feel like we costumes. can't be our true selves. You know what I'm saying? Wow. Yeah, dude. Well, I think I can speak for everyone when I say, yeah, we want to do events. It's just that things are still a little wacky out there. That's all. Yeah. I don't want to do that many events, I'll be honest yeah. with you. Yeah, like of course I want to do that <laughs> shit, but it's just it's just not an ideal time. Julia might not be there when we do the events, <laughs> but the rest of us want to do them. Julia yeah. will plan the events, and then we will do the events. I will do all the administrative steps of the events. And then you can come to any events you want to. And then I'll lay on the floor. Yeah. As a treat. As that is the true con life. I'm done. God, this is great. I, I Thank miss you. suffering. This is adorable. It's, it's the lamb from the game. It's the lamb from the game. <laughs> yeah, you don't know true convention suffering until you do AX at least once and have like some sort of building damage occur at a con you've been to. Yeah, <laughs> That's the you. real shit. That's the good shit. You've mm. been in the real shit. <laughs> I've Oh yeah, and that time I got trapped in easy. Atlantic City. That was great. <laughs> <laughs> I always forget about that. The saddest thing about that is that I got stuck there Sunday, but I was still like really fresh to starting at College Humor and I like felt so bad about missing days. So I like took a six AM bus back to Manhattan and then I just went straight to work. That's brutal from Atlantic City with all my convention shit on me. That's illegal. Yeah. You should have been put in jail. I used to live like that. <laughs> Draw yeah. Julia the Terror Bird animatronic Terror bird. from memory. Terror bird animatronic from memory. Terror Bird animatronic from memory. Okay. Terror yeah. Bird animatronic from memory. me. <laughs> I don't know if anyone in the chat right now is going to any of our Seattle live shows, but I was just thinking earlier today that this is a good beak. I feel like you busted yeah. out such a good <laughs> beak. Wow, you foresaw this earlier today? I just looked at it on the screen and I was like, that's like a perfect beak. Yeah. Um, anyways. It's like good at art. Anyways, what I was going to say yeah. is that I was thinking earlier about the, the people who are going to be at the Thursday night show are truly going to see us doing the first live show we've done in literal years. Like the years. first time doing Drawfee in front of other people yeah. in, in years. And I don't know. Yeah. I mean, I'm planning to bring the heat and the energy and oh, the yeah. vibe, but who knows how it's going to go. I mean, I feel like technically I've never done a Drawfee live. Yeah, you did the, the draw. The only draga. live show I did, did was draga. draga, where I said, Nathan, do I have to prepare anything? And you said no. And then I had no idea what to say or do. <laughs> you did great. Thank you. I was super nervous. <laughs> I was super nervous. I missed. I I missed a whole bit about your character being tiny. <laughs> and then when everyone was telling me to make it smaller, I didn't understand why. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I'm really excited. It's, it's going to be, be fun. fun. We just said I that bought, at the exact same time. I bought a new hat for the trip. A hat? Oh, yeah. For the trip? I, I'm entering my bucket hat era. I went, wow. I went to Chinatown yesterday to get some uh, skincare from the nice old lady who works at Tony Moly. And I passed by one of those tourist shops and they had the little bucket hats that have the frog on them, like the eyes and then the smile. Oh. And I just walked up and said, I want the frog hat. And he's like, yeah, they're inside. <laughs> <laughs> I and want I like, the frog hat. Uh, yeah, okay, I'm in a now. hurry. Now. <laughs> I was in a hurry, I had food. I don't want it to go cold. I could bring my my Cham Clowder hat. Yeah. <laughs> I still have it. It's right here. Oh. I got mine in the closet. I have mine somewhere. Are you going to wear a hat for the one of the live shows, Karina? Are you going to be 
I wasn't planning to. It's more for the days in between where I don't want to wash my hair. That's fair. That's what I use hats for as well. Yo, yeah. That's a cool brush. What brush is that? Ooh. It's a rough crosshatch. Nice. Yeah, that's pretty sick. Nathan, sick. the way you're wearing that hat is sick. <laughs> over, over top of my headphones. Yeah. Yeah. Do you like it? It's good? It's good. I like this uh, this bird, and I like all the emotions that it evokes within me when I look at it. Is one of them terror? Yeah, mostly it, terror, I'd it say. It is a terror bird. Mostly terror, but there's some other ones in there. Shame. I would feel more terror if it screamed at me. It's preparing to, it looks like. Okay. That's this is like when you go into the pet store, and they have like the cockatiels. <laughs> that are like that haven't been played with or like engaged with in a while other than people talking to them and they're like buzzing to get out and then well, they just said, scream you said it was motion activated this one yeah so yeah like it, it just like noticed birds. some some motion yeah <laughs> the motion sensors go bzzz, and it goes Wah! someone said is this what the inside of this restaurant looks like yeah this is like the entry room you walk into a very dark room <laughs> before you get into the actual restaurant. And if you bump into this bird in the darkness, like a spotlight hits it and it just screams at you. It's also six feet tall. It is six feet tall. Yeah, so rem it's very please easy remember to that. Bump into. Yeah. <laughs> it's six feet tall and six feet wide. It's a thick bird. Yeah. I love the hatching on this. Yeah, it's a cool brush. I got to get that. Thank well, you, Jacob. I had it. It, it's a default, I believe. Yeah. What? Yeah. If it's in English, it might be a default. <laughs> Should I do the another default. drawing? Because that was real fast. If your brush is in English, you might be a default. You might. Be. I saw someone say Muppet of the Opera. Muppet, the Muppet of the Opera. Muppet of the Opera is there. Have you drawn that before? Or am I projecting? I have not drawn that, I don't think. I was projecting okay. my voice just then. You sure wow. you were, Jacob. And I ignored it. <laughs> <laughs> so a Muppet of the Opera does not necessarily say Kermit. Just make a Muppet of the Phantom of the Opera. <gasps> There's no need to go just wild here. Muppet OC. <laughs> There's no Jacob. need to make this weird, Julia. Uh -oh. That thing you said about it being our first live show in years, it's just like, it's just dawning on me that, like, there's going to be an audience reacting to our bullshit. Yeah. <laughs> We're going to know immediately if what we said was funny or not. Yeah, yeah. If, it, if it landed or, or not. Yeah. <laughs> I think, though... Um, the people are going to be so hyped yeah. that it's going to be like easy mode. Yeah. Also because, and yeah, this is, this is new. This is Patreon exclusive news, <gasps> but I'm, right, I'm cause... putting together a little, a little compilation of drawfy clips and bits and things. You might see some familiar stuff in there. Yeah, wink wonk. And and it's gonna be like thirty minutes before the show starts. You're gonna be watching all some of our best clips, some of our hottest shit. You're gonna be laughing and you're gonna be thinking in your head. I'm gonna be seeing them come out on stage once this is over. And so by the time we come out, the people are gonna be like tearing out their hair. They're gonna be like vomiting. They're gonna be passing out. It's gonna be yeah. such incredible hype. Please do not vomit at the live show because masks are required and it will just be in your mask yeah, it'll and be it will bad. spill all over you. Yeah. Yeah, and so try not to vomit. Try not yeah. to vomit. If you do vomit, it's okay, but you should probably go home. Just play yeah, you it have cool. to leave then, unfortunately. Yeah. One time. <laughs> the <subway. laughs> On the way to the bell house to see Welcome to Night Vale Live. Um uh my friend and i noticed a weird smell and we turned around and realized the person sitting behind us uh like had just vomited like down her front but she played it so cool because we were just like okay we're gonna get up and move because it's stinky but like should we do anything about her like should we help her don't know what to do in this situation 
Um, but she was just holding it in. And then Sometimes. she just got up and left with quiet yeah. dignity at the next stop. And I'm Damn. just like, she's, Sometimes your she's body a trooper. Just decides this this stuff got to get out. Yeah. We've all been there. I wish that's you what hope? I had done the last time I had to vomit, but I didn't. And now Spencer tells everyone about it. So. <laughs> Thanks, dude. One time. I So I haven't <laughs> had the the train vomiting <laughs> experience thankfully yeah thankfully. i've dodged that one so far yet in in my you know 20s my early 20s i definitely vomited outside of some bars for sure um which was unfortunate but who who among us Me. who among us aside among from us. julia has not <laughs> yeah um <laughs> julia, just me. <laughs> who among us Me. <laughs> and uh, and then one time, and then some. I think what scares me more, because like most of the time when I have to vomit, it's because I I drank too much, which I don't really do anymore. So I haven't had that issue in a long time. But when you have like the bad shits, and they just kind of come up on you, that's like not even your fault, <laughs> and you don't Your even know when it's a temple. you don't even know when it's gonna happen. And so Wait, we're not saving this combo for the live show. <laughs> this could be our opener. <laughs> the bad shits. Yeah. Hey, who? Hey. Hey. Hey, Seattle. What's up, Seattle? Hey, who has ever had the bad shits? You yeah. ever had the bad shits? Y'all ever, ha yeah, ever had the. Hey. <laughs> Raise your hand. Yeah, gonna draw a persona for the bad shits. <laughs> oh, wait. No. That wouldn't. That'd be too appropriate. One time I had to sprint from Prospect Park to the Brooklyn Museum of Art at full speed to avoid shitting my pants. Did you make it? I made it. I tried to go to the library because that's closer, but it was it was it was closed that day. Um, and then I was like, the only other place I can think of is the Brooklyn Museum of Art, and I thought it was closer closer to me than it was, mm. and it was not. And things were getting well, dire, so sure I was just wouldn't. like flat out sprinting wow all the and way I, there you would think that the sprinting would would cause <laughs> would make the would make the poop come out but you you were able to clench and sprint i had to like the new bend and I, snap i could tell <laughs> <laughs> clench and sprint <laughs> legally blonde very different that's how you get your man that's how you get your <laughs> man and you, you go clench and sprint <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> the, that motivational scene in the nail salon, very different. Very different. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. Continue. There's there's not really much else. I was you made it. You I was just it. gonna say there's like there comes oh. a time in your mind where you have to gauge like what's the higher risk factor. Right. Like taking extra time or exerting extra effort right and at that one i was like if i take any extra time it's over it's over, it's over. so like i have to do a gamble and do a lot yeah. of extra effort to try and lower the time but well, i did make it thank it's you a great story jacob thank you <laughs> and, it's brave of you to share it thank you i'm very brave you're a brave boy it's okay. I didn't even know they had a public bathroom at the Brooklyn Museum of it's, Art. It's nice, actually. They yeah, got one right nice in the building. lobby. Yeah, and it's a nice building. That's why it surprises me. <laughs> nice ba building, nice bathroom. Yeah, usually they'd be more stingy about that shit. No, is not it, there. Is it the Brook? Is the Brooklyn Museum of Art different from the Brooklyn Art Museum? Or is it the same? I museum? I don't know. I have isn't to assume of, they're the same. Isn't one of them, because one of them is, is BAM, right? Bam. BAM is different. BAM. Okay. BAM is in like that, downtown Brooklyn. Is that not the, is the A not art? Is it something else? Isn't BAM like the Brooklyn Art, Brooklyn Academy of M Meat? M meat. I don't, <laughs> <laughs> BAM is something, and I've been there too, but they have like theaters and stuff. Oh, okay. I think it's like a different thing. Brooklyn Academy of Music. Music. Okay, got it. Well, then that's what that stands for. 
Okay. I, and I learned something. I like that I learned something on yeah. every Drawfee stream. Julia, you're I, I absolutely know. killing it on this drawing, <laughs> yeah, by the way. Just, while we're talking about the most horrid shit, literally. This is um, so good. Like, yeah. I, you could have you could have used like an extant Muppet and cast them in the role, but I like that you just made a new one. <laughs> yeah, it's better. It's better it's like this. It's what he deserves. And it looks like he really just doesn't want to deal with being the Phantom of the Opera today. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine this is his face as he's watching that ballad between. <laughs> and uh, he's hiding behind the yeah. statue, like. <laughs> and he hears Christine being like, "All I ask of rose. you." It's like. <laughs> Christine singing to Patrick. Yeah. What's his name? Warburton. Is no. that his name? No, certainly <laughs> not. <laughs> Christine. <laughs> I love oh, yeah, you. Christine. Oh, Christine. <laughs> oh, we got to get out of the opera. <laughs> the, opera. the opera specifically haunted by this phantom. There's, a, fa there's a phantom in here in the, the opera. Phantom's opera. Oh, yeah. <laughs> the, the phantom's opera. Oh, my God. Phantom's opera. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. The chandelier. <laughs> Oh, the chandelier, the chandelier that's been cut. That's cut that it's fallen. <laughs> the chandelier specifically cut so that it would fall. The falling chandelier. So I do mean Patrick Warburton. Yeah. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> what is that guy's actual name? I can't think of it. That actor. Isn't it Patrick? Yeah. It's uh, an owl from Watchmen. Deep yeah. Blue Link says, I've got to run. Thanks for the awful poop talk to round it out. You're welcome. Well, you better get going before you shit your pants. Bye. Bye. Oh, my God. What's his actual name? He's in freaking... Patrick Wilson. Wilson. Patrick wow. Wilson. Thank you. Wilson. He's in like every Wilson. horror movie. Wilson. Oh, God. Yeah. Patrick Warburton. <laughs> <laughs> I do love Patrick Warburton, though. Yeah. He makes me laugh every time. Everything he does. He's got a good voice. Good and all voice he's got to do is he's it. just got to be him, you know? Yeah. That's beautiful. Ugh. First saw him in Seinfeld. Yep. As Putty. As Putty. Which is a great name for a character. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Puddy. Puddy. Honk. Oh, knife truck. Knife truck's outside. Knife truck's knife outside. Truck? Knife truck? Does anybody need their knife sharpened? Does anybody need their knife sharpened? Oh, oh boy. The knife Bring sharpening out truck. Knives. I've read reviews on the knife truck. Apparently, it does a very bad job. <laughs> <laughs> That's like your whole thing. He does one Aww. thing and he's not and very good at it. It's not very good. Sir. Sir. It's Fuki Kabuki said I watched John Barrowman eat a banana and then throw the peel over a wall with Patrick Warburton at a Comic Con once. Wow, what a story. <laughs> what a what tale. A scene. <laughs> I just like it. You know, sometimes I think about, I think it was at the the mocha we were at before this most recent mocha, the one. <laughs> the shading really got you. The shading there. got yeah. you. The shading Give really made it one is... punch okay. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> they really did make it that. He's watching the chandelier fall like he's the okay like, gift. He's just like, okay. Yeah, okay. people are just running, screaming, and like there's glass <laughs> flying by him. <laughs> Sorry to interrupt you, Jacob. I just I couldn't help I, myself. I wasn't saying anything as funny as this. I wasn't even saying anything funny at all. I just was going to say John Leguizamo was there, and I kept seeing him. And I just, oh, yeah. it was just like. Who's that? He's the the voice of like everything. Oh, he's, he's in Moulin voice, Rouge. He's, he's the, the voice, voice of Bruno. Of, uh, Bruno oh, and Sid in Ice Age. Oh, and, and also he's. Um, you know I don't know things. He's Tybalt 
in the Leonardo DiCaprio. Oh yeah, uh, Romeo, uh, and, Romeo Juliet. and Juliet, right? Yeah, he's been in like a bazillion things, and a very. And you didn't ask him to be on Giraffe. I thought we didn't talk about him. Good, we... <laughs> Good point. Yeah. Clever. Clever. Um, in any case, if you're not expecting to see John Leguizamo and then suddenly he's just like walking around, it's just kind of a weird. An unexpected Leguizamo. It's a weird vibe. I would yeah. literally never know if a celebrity was walking around. In front of <laughs> yeah, clearly. Yeah. And that's your, that's your superpower. <laughs> Gordon Ramsay himself could walk up to you. Yeah. I have no idea. He'll call like, you a donkey. <laughs> and be like, me? <laughs> like, why is this guy so mean? Yeah, why is this man <laughs> approaching why is, me? Why is this and then man I push so him angry? off the subway platform. <laughs> why is this man assigning me a furry persona? I don't That's even know. That's not even what my persona is. Uh, idiot. <laughs> And then 30 minutes later, I'd be like, wait a second. <laughs> Can you imagine this face saying, sing to me, my angel of music? Yes. <laughs> the mouth yes, just like opening and closing. <laughs> sing to me. <laughs> but he's doing that like Muppet was sing to me. Yeah, the arms are flapping yeah. around. <laughs> but I also like the, the mental image of him literally like this, sing to me. <laughs> now you sound like H. John Benjamin. <laughs> oh wait, he was Luigi in the Mario movie? Yeah. He was Luigi in the Mario oh, movie. Oh my gosh, I saw that movie when I was so young, I didn't even know who actors were. Yeah, me too, and I hated I'm still, it. I'm still at that age. <laughs> Someday when you're when you're older. <laughs> Karina still thinks it's all real what she's seeing. Yeah, you telling me you telling me that panda movie, red panda movie, that wasn't real life? <laughs> Nathan, you Tell want me that was real? That was real. This? When am yeah. I turning into a panda? Pass it. Yeah. Pass it back to me. Remember this? Remember this? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Remember, Remember this? I'll never forget. What um, what should I draw? Let's get one for Nathan. Let's hear let's it get, for the Nathan. Let's get me one and see what it becomes. Because I believe the prompt for this one was draw the new Pokemon from the. Trailer. And you did. And, and you, you did. did. I kind of did, yeah. Uh, the new Splatoon idols. Oh don't yeah. Don't know if oh, you've yeah. seen them, but they're pretty good. They're they're very fun. New. Yeah. Splatoon. Draw detectives idols. in Seattle. I don't know what's in Seattle. You could draw Big Ranger. Man. From Fish market from Splatoon. Yeah, the last time I was in Seattle, I just got bullied for four days straight, and then I came home and half of my face scaled because the weather made my skin weird. <laughs> and yet I choose to go back. <laughs> Damn, should we bully you the whole time we're there? Yeah, it'll help me ease into the mood. <laughs> <laughs> Eugene, but he's from Maryland. What does it even mean? <laughs> Just give, a give him that look, that Marilyn look. He's eating some crabs. People in Maryland have the historically the just the big wide mouth to fit the crabs in. Right. Yeah. Because yeah. they just put them in whole horizontally. All right, Eugene from Maryland. <laughs> Do it. Eugene from Maryland. <laughs> the resigned. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Eugene Drop Tech. Show him, I love show when people boy. request like a straight, a, just a straight up thing. Someone just suggested Shy Guy. I'm like, yeah. <laughs> yeah. I yeah. just want to see him. I mean, yeah. Just I agree show with me you. Shy Guy. Yeah, you're right. Like, yeah. I like Shy Guy. I love Shy Guy. Shy Guy's the character I pick every time. <laughs> We play a Mario thing, and you, I could pick a character. Shy Guy's great. Just so that when I roll the dice, when I switch dice, he goes wah, 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 wah. <laughs> I played him in Mario Kart. He was my Mario Kart main. Wow. Until I switched to Isabella. Wow. It was because too many people were playing Shy Guy, and I didn't feel unique enough. Oh, wow. I yeah. have to feel unique. 
to yeah, a certain well, degree. <laughs> we all know Jacob's got mad pick me energy. Yeah. Jacob and I have been playing. This is unrelated to this conversation, <laughs> but Jacob and I have been playing um, the Yakuza like a dragon. Oh, yeah. Which is excellent. But we just did a side quest where this guy has a pet lobster. It's a crawfish. It's a crawfish. Sorry. He has, he has a pet crawfish. crawfish. And uh, you think that it's just a loose crawfish. So you throw it into the river. And the guy's like, no, Nancy. <laughs> so you have to go Nancy. get Nancy back. And you get Nancy back after the guy's like, I've raised her since she was born i've had her for years she's my best friend and you bring her back and uh he immediately wants to cook her so instead what you do is that you get him a, a premium sushi set and you trade the sushi set for nancy and then you can use nancy in battle yeah you can what does she do she's a summon yeah she's she a, a summon. summon she <laughs> rain she rains out of the sky with a bunch of other crawfish and landing on the enemies and then she leaps at one of them and does like a anime style like stab into their face. And they're like, like they're like this and the crawdad is like in their face. That's funny. And then she, uh, she like spins off of them and she lands very like. Like a samurai yeah, pose. Yeah, like, like this, but with her claw. Yeah. And then the person collapses in the background. It's pretty excellent. That. <laughs> and then the main character from Like a Dragon also just walks with her on his shoulder for a cutscene. Oh, it's very cute. Wow. It's great. Yeah. Wonderful Every, video game. Everything I hear about Yakuza is great. Like a Dragon is my favorite Yakuza game by far. Hell yeah. It's very good. If you like, I was going to say, if you like daddies. <laughs> and I stand by it. If you yeah, like yeah. daddies, this one's all daddies. This one's all well, daddies. Shit. Well, it's shit. mostly dudes in in their forties to sixties. Yeah. Uh, who uh, lose their job and become homeless and become best friends, and then they get jobs together and they work fight on, their way out of yeah, homelessness. They fight their way out of homelessness <laughs> and become friends with all of the working class people in town, and they all form just like a big friend group. Precious, oh, that's precious. Tight. It's really precious. They're all—all all of the characters are stupid. Stop! Does my time. They're all sweet, stupid. Stop. Older men. I'll introduce Stop. you to them, Karina. Yeah. Ah, I only know uh, the main two from the main. Uh, what was it, Yakuza Four? Mm. Yeah, Kiryu and yeah, Majima. Majima. Yeah. Majima is fun. Kiryu. I love whenever Kiryu. I think, yeah, it's Because I, I have plenty of friends who simp for Majima. And whenever I think about it, I can't help but think of this one clip from Vinny Vine Sauce where he's like, I don't know much about Majima, but what I do know is that people are squirting horny for him. <laughs> <laughs> and that's just stuck in my brain. <laughs> core core memory. <laughs> yeah. For um, any time I think of Machima. <laughs> Squirting horny. <laughs> Unbelievable thing to say. <laughs> I love it. But it's true. It's yeah. true. It's very true. <laughs> From what I know, yeah, that tracks. Jacob just met a character in Like a Dragon who is this lady construction worker who just gets really excited about an old bat you found and she soups it up to be like a super bat. Ooh. And she runs, what is her garage called? I forget, What's but like, she, she loves like building super. shit. Is it like it love gets, magic? It's like romance it? something. Yeah. <laughs> she wears a pink uh, coveralls. Oh, hell yeah. She's great. She's one of my favorites. <laughs> Nathan, this is wild. Yeah. <laughs> this is Eugene from Maryland. The just a guyification of Eugene Finch. <laughs> <laughs> this does seem like a New Yorker comic, weirdly enough. Um, gotta have... What would the caption be? I'm going to pull up a random New Yorker cartoon caption. Kevin asked if we're taking suggestions for the Seattle shows beforehand or during the show. That's a good question. I got an answer for you. 
Whoa. And it's going to blow your freaking mind when you hear it. When you go to the show, there's going to be a QR code you scan and it takes you on your phone to the place where you put in the suggestions and then it compiles them all in the freaking back end for us to access on the stage. So it's kind of both. It's like at the show, Whoa. but not during the show. Cause we've, we've tried during the show and it's too chaotic. Yeah. Once you, once you break the, you can shout at us seal, you can't un. Then that's all you, the show becomes. That's, yeah. It, it's over. Yeah. So we can, And if we can you never, shout at me, we can never do that ever. I again. will cry. Yeah. That's a and promise. And then what? And then what? The and show is what ruined. Do. Yeah. We, we all have to cry stop. Karina. <laughs> we all have to yeah. stop. I'll need to be calmed down by every single member of the team individually. And we don't know how long that'll take. It varies. So it yeah. could take up most of the show. And then once I'm calm, I need to go wash my face. So don't yell. It's rude. <laughs> so don't yeah, yell. Again, it's yeah. We you know it was our our fault for telling people they could yell a little. People don't understand that. Once you tell someone they can yell, it's a they don't it's stop. a binary switch. Yeah. that's either off or on, and if you turn it on, you can't turn it back so off. That was, it locks. You know, we we learned. We did a learn from our our few times we did New York Comic Con. We can't do those. We can't let the people yell. No, the people mm -hmm. must not yell. But we still want it to be interactive. So the QR code yeah. solves that. that. That's not to say you need to just sit there in silence. Just, oh, yeah, no. You know. Laugh, <laughs> engage. Yeah, you can hoot. Yeah. You can hoot and holler. You can, you, can yeah. a hoop, you can a hoop and a holler. Just know, make sure that whatever, what, you're allowed to make loud sounds, but they can't be words. Yeah. yeah. So if you laugh loudly or scream, or or whoop or go you can even I'll even make a concession and say you can go yeah yeah but that's like as close as it. you can we get. get it some people project naturally like my old downstairs neighbor who used to sneeze with the might of Zeus but you know I don't understand why why people gotta sneeze like that it's so loud just tone it down. Like, it, fe it feels like he just a choice. naturally was loud. It, yeah, it, fe but, it feels like a choice. It definitely maybe. was a choice, but like it he feels like all, a choice. I that could all also dads hear do. every noise. He was a dad. Yeah, every dad feels just like they need to the young <laughs> to clear some, the room with a sneeze. Because some people <laughs> sneeze like <laughs> yeah, <laughs> and that also feels like a choice. <laughs> you, can, you can say my name. <laughs> <laughs> you don't need to be coy about it, Jesus. Shit. <laughs> You're not the only one who does that. <laughs> Some people like me sneeze and it just sounds like a cough. And I think that's the only appropriate way to sneeze. Fair. Like I'll ham it up for, for a laugh for a yeah. goop if I feel it coming. I can go either way. I can go a chee. <laughs> or I can go, uh, or I can go, wow! I chew. Sometimes I just try and like shout a word while I'm sneezing. Just go, hey! <laughs> you can wow, do that. Just like my old downstairs neighbor. Yeah. That's allowed at the show. You can do that. Yeah. Go it, better, it better sound like a sneeze. Yeah. And you have hey. to have your mask on when you're sneezing. Yeah. 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 Hey, hey, Nathan. Yeah. Can you explain terps to me? It's terrapin, right? It's the the mascot of the University of Maryland is the Maryland terrapin. <laughs> and you shorten that to terps. <laughs> My alma mater. What's a terrapin? It's a land-based turtle. It's just a little turtle. <laughs> there was also an Athens thing <laughs> because we have a brewery called Terrapin in Athens, Georgia, where I went to college. Wow. So we're talking about Terrapin all the time. He's got his O's hat. He's got his Terp shirt. He's eating, <laughs> Terp he's shirt. Pouring, he's pouring Old Bay on a crab. I don't know. Crab's I, like, I just I love this. this comment in chat. That's my new roommate sneezes like it's in lowercase. Yeah. <laughs> a chew. A chew. I, I'm trying to sneeze like <laughs> I'm in italics, you know? A 
Achoo. <laughs> <laughs> and lowercase. Oh my Maybe god. Like, how many legs do crabs have? Enough. I'm looking at uh, the cutest terrapin ever. North River lie. terrapin. Eight legs and then two claws. And the claws, yeah. Look at him. He's got a smile. He's got a little <gasps> nose and a smile. That's a happy tort. What happy else? terp. I like it. It could be at Ocean City. <laughs> Ocean City is the laziest name. Yeah, like, gee, I wonder where it is. <laughs> What's the deal with this city? <laughs> yeah, I wonder what it's by. <laughs> it's, it's not any more or less creative than Long Island. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> well, I wonder what the length of this island is. I wonder what <laughs> this island's about. <laughs> or New York. Yeah. <laughs> or New Jersey. Like, we're just doing it again. We can't think of a, a different name. Oh, yeah. What is the name of that uh, the ice cream shop? Core Bros? Luigi's. Luigi's the Italian Ice. With the Old Bay ice cream? Old Bay. Ample I've Hills. Been there. You're just going to keep saying it. <laughs> um. Hills. Have, has anyone, gonna... have you had the Old Bay ice cream? Anyone? I, I think I tried it. I don't think I got it. I want to know what it's like. It's good. Okay. I forget what it was. Was it? Is it like caramel with Old Bay? I don't know. I just heard someone talking about it recently or it was on a show or something. <laughs> Honk. 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 Yeah. I've had it. <laughs> you ever put some Old Bay on some popcorn? I don't think I have. Yeah. You have because we went to High Dive. And they got they got the popcorn and you can put the old bay on it there. That's right. I have. Love a, a dive bar with popcorn in it pre pandemic. Yes. Because <laughs> you was just self serve. It was just a big popcorn machine. You just went up and took a big scoop of Rooney. All right. It was free. <laughs> Will the sirens be at the live show? We should add <laughs> like An occasional car honk. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Can we get a button? <laughs> Frozzy Krusty is them. my favorite Muppet. <laughs> That's Frozy Custy. It's just, it, it's, I just didn't feel like writing frozen custard. It's Frozy Custy. <laughs> it's, it's, Frozy it's, Custy. I don't like the word Custy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah it's, just, it's like borderline. Yeah, it sounds like something gross. It sounds like something you could scrape. <laughs> Frozy Custard. Yeah. <laughs> I'm about to explain what Old Bay is because someone in the chat asked and said they're from the UK and they don't have it. Okay. So Old Bay is it's one of the best seasoning blends. It's just a yeah. They got out there. What's it it's got, good. Jacob? Um, I'll tell you right now, it's synonymous with seafood and nostalgia. Wow, not for me. It's got uh it's like one of the only seasoning blends that uses celery salt in a way that I don't find yeah. gross. Yeah, it includes <laughs> but is not limited to celery seed, paprika, mustard, salt, red pepper and black pepper. Unfortunately, the remaining spices and herbs remain a mystery to cool. those outside of McCormick. <laughs> Although many have tried to crack the code. How how hard can it be? There's only so many. I know, there's only so many seasons. I don't think they're trying that hard. Uh, have they tried salt? Yeah, is it salt? Is it salt? Salt was one of the listed ingredients that I said. <laughs> but have they tried Pepper. It? I'll tell you what's in this Old Bay seasoning <laughs> is substitute. There pepper? Did they list pepper? Yeah, is there pepper in it? All right, get, get a load of this. Everybody shut up <laughs> and listen. Okay. Celery salt, paprika, black pepper, cayenne pepper, mustard, nutmeg, cinnamon, cardamom, allspice, cloves, and ginger. They didn't say regular pepper, though. They didn't what say regular What is regular, regular salt? pepper? <laughs> There's not salt in it. There is salt in it. You said celery salt. Celery is there regular salt? salt? Is, is salt. Celery salt is made of salt. salt. That's not just salt. Regular... Regular, regular. But celery salt 
is salt. Is there dust in it? There's probably dust in it. People should try that. Dust? Now I'm Googling celery salt. All right, this is this is the most Maryland image I could the, conjure. The primary ingredient is table salt in celery salt. So there's more ingredients. The, and the flavoring agent is ground seeds from celery or its relative lovage. Don't know what so lovage is. So it's flavored is. salt. It's not regular salt. But the flavored salt is like 90% salt. So it still contains yeah, regular salt. Flavor. We, have to, we have to move on. Okay. I will never move on. I'm right. Karina, do you want to draw? Yeah, I'll draw. Okay, you got you got 13 minutes. Give me the screen. Have they tried? What should I draw? Celery salt. Cinnamon. No, regular salt. <laughs> I don't think there's cinnamon in it. Maybe there is, but I don't think so. We don't know. We don't know. If we it's don't in know. there, it's very subtle. Have they it, tried? It mostly tastes like <laughs> like chili pepper and uh, and celery salt. <laughs> People are saying gay gargoyle. Do you mean this guy? <laughs> Can I draw him? Draw, draw gay him. gargoyle fan art. Yeah, I love him. If I were incredibly frivolous and had three hundred dollars to spare, maybe I'd buy him for myself. But unfortunately, uh, other things I could be frivolous with that money about. <laughs> You're almost that frivolous, but not I'm quite. Almost that frivolous. It if it were like an anime figure, <laughs> this would be a bigger question. I need to look at him. It is an anime figure from the cartoon show Gargoyles. Oh my God, put him in like, oh. What if you get one of those posable like Phoenix Wright figurines and then take <laughs> off the head and put the Gargoyles head on it instead? <laughs> so he looks like, so he looks like he's in Phoenix Wright suit. What if that, Karina? <laughs> what if that? What if that? <laughs> what would your life be like if you did that? I have a legal question. I'd be poorer. What? If you have a product that you sell that is uh -huh. that is consumed by humans, uh -huh. Uh -huh. don't you legally have to list everything that's in your recipe in case someone's like allergic or whatever? Yeah, it doesn't matter that much. Just sell it through TikTok. Yeah, pink. Are you talking about pink sauce? <laughs> we're, we're talking about Old Bay. <laughs> Old Bay is basically the original pink sauce. Yeah. What is that? It was a whole thing <laughs> on the internet. Oh, you, you didn't. Wow. Congrats. Just look it up after I've, this. I've not been on social media at all. I, you are. For my congrats. mental health, I decided just, as a treat, just, I wouldn't. I'm, I'm happy for you and jealous <laughs> may contain horse. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, yeah, that's a good question for allergies. Um, I think it, if if they're like common allergens, they have to be like may contain nuts or whatever. But I think that as long as it's FDA approved, they don't have to list all the ingredients if it's like a secret recipe. I think I think maybe someone someone in the approval process has to know what all the ingredients are. But it's uh, it's a legal. Yeah. They can't. They I can't guess it's share just it. at that they point. Have to sign a, a NDA, and you just gotta avoid it. Yeah, I guess they do have the probably the FDA. The FDA knows. Yeah. Yeah. What's in it? And they're like, it's. They're basically just looking to us and being like, don't worry about it. It's fine. <laughs> yeah, I love when guys do that. We saw what's in <laughs> it, and it's not anything you need to be concerned with. You don't need to worry. About it. It's just good stuff. In Old Bay, it's just good stuff. Yeah, it's yeah. good stuff in there. <laughs> it's so. just, Haha, don't it, worry about it, babe. <laughs> it just makes your fries and your popcorn and your seafood taste really good. So don't worry about it. Don't be weird about this. It's yeah. Face. Big old cheeks. I remember. Uh, I remember in high school, like the the big thing at the high school cafeteria was you could get fries and people would just like douse them in Old Bay. And why that's wouldn't you? Yeah, yeah, that that's me with QB mayo. <laughs> Do that too. Put both. Yeah. Put the Old Bay in the QB mayo. You have yourself a damn treat. Oh shit. Becca Bo says, I, uh, I found a picture of a crab hugging a tin of Old Bay and it doesn't feel correct. I mean, <laughs> here's the thing. 
if I knew someone was gonna eat me, I'd be like, well, at least make me taste good, you know? Yeah, you better drown me in Kewpie mayo. <laughs> or else I'll make sure that I taste like shit. <laughs> <laughs> You're not gonna like what you get. Yeah. <laughs> I'm always doing the Kewpie mayo, and I put the the, the chili uh, sauce oh, in it. The, oh, the sriracha chili paste. Not yeah, the paste. And sambal? I put that in it, and then Remember? and then it's not sambal. It's the sriracha branded chili paste oh, with gotcha. the garlic in it too. It's like a garlic chili paste. Gotcha. Put that in the mayo, mix it all up, spread that bad boy on a sandwich. Mm. It's good. Have mm. yourself a damn time. Like a good uh, gochujang mayo as oh, well. Oh, yeah. Oh, come on. You're telling me. <laughs> yes. And I'm, and I'm listening. In like, in like early 2022, uh, Emily and I got on a real like frozen tater tots kick. That's so we, valid. Just like order, <laughs> you just order a bunch of bags of the. You know, we were just going for stuff you can freeze, keep for a while. Because who knows what the supply chain, what is happening? And tater tots just good. And tater tots just good. They're very yeah. comforting. And so, I would just like mix various condiments in my fridge with mayo. And uh, and dip it and dip yeah. it. Yeah, it won't be bad. That's the thing. Even people that are like, I don't like mayo. You That's... you you put it in front of them and say this is an aioli because you mix something in it. Suddenly their whole tune's changing. Oh yeah, that is May me. Mayo... I hate regular mayo. It's nasty. Something th about it just ain't right. This isn't an original thought I, I had, but I, I agree with it that mayo rebranding as aioli is one of like the the smartest moves it's ever made. <laughs> I agree. It it Just changes like, no, no, it. No, no, no. It's it's aioli. This is yeah. different. This is a garlic mm. aioli. Aioli. Yeah, and suddenly I'm like, okay, I'm listening. What, what's the main ingredient? Mayo. <laughs> yeah, the first time I had an aioli, it's, I it's got eggs. I got very sick because my tummy's <laughs> bad. So every Aww. time I hear aioli, I go, oh, can't have that. <laughs> that's it for me. But that's not true no more. That's Mayo. not true no Because you, you eat the Kewpie. Well, what happened was that I got something that had, it was like an aioli, but it really hurt my stomach, like basically immediately. And the waitress came over and she's like, oh, why didn't you finish your food? And I was like, uh, what? <laughs> <laughs> okay, first of all, that's not your business. <laughs> yeah, and I was like, uh, because You're I'm like, dad. I'm, I'm allergic to something that's on the plate. And she's like, she goes, oh, why didn't you tell us you were allergic to something? And I was like, I. Aw. <laughs> she's just doing her job. I don't know what, I don't know oh, what aioli is. is. <laughs> it hurt my tummy. Aw. I got the tummy grumps. My tummy's sometimes, bad. Sometimes the tummy just decides it don't like something. My tummy doesn't like anything that's too heavy, and it was a very heavy aioli. Aww. Except I gotta say though, mac and cheese. I'm always saying <laughs> this about Julia's tummy. It's gotten better. It, it's gotten way better. I think nice. because she's had to eat. Because I'm around and I'm always making whatever <laughs> dumb bullshit. Yeah. And I try to always make it so that it's like, you know, Julia. Stomach approved. Uh, approved. Yeah. But I feel like there's always like little bits of it that's like maybe slightly outside or like slightly tweaked. I think we've been like slowly introducing. I think also the thing that's helping a lot is that I'm eating three meals a day as opposed to what I was doing before, which was like one or two, maybe. Yeah. No schedule for when I eat. No. <laughs> Just eating whenever. I decide that now is the time to eat. Yeah, that's true. We got a regular meals. We got our regular nice. meals over here, not to brag. Jacob wow. makes sure I eat every, three times a day. Oh, just amazing to have. Just like the cats. Yeah. <laughs> wow, a third cat. <laughs> Do the cats, the cats eat what? They eat four like four times, times a, day? a day. Yeah. 
greedy. <laughs> well, they kind of eat whenever they're hungry, but we do we do dole out food four times a day because we dole out little bits so that yeah. Joy doesn't scoff it all down and then throw up immediately. <laughs> little goblin. She's sitting on the desk. Oh my God, Karina, that ass cheek. He's got a big ass. He's thinking. You just like, <laughs> you executed the fold of the ass cheek so quickly. Yeah. That was what like, can I say? I'm familiar. <laughs> expert level. I was just impressed. You just like yeah, did good. it to him. I'm glad. I'm glad this is how we're ending the stream. Feels, yeah. It feels like he's saying, well, thanks for stopping by. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Thanks for stopping by my garden. <laughs> Come back anytime and we can have more riveting conversations. Yeah. I'm going to keep sitting here and weighing down this rug. Whoa. I'll be thinking <laughs> about our last visit for a long time. <laughs> oh, your girlfriend doesn't like me? Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Might be time to get a new one. Yeah. <laughs> it's 2022, baby. Do whatever makes you happy. <laughs> How do you feel about gargoyles? <laughs> I love gargoyles. I would love if this became the symbol of 2022. Embrace, embrace what makes you happy. Embrace the gargoyle. Embrace yeah, the gargoyle. What makes me happy is the gargoyle. <laughs> embrace the gargoyle is the phrase I'm going to use to mean like, do what makes you happy. Yeah, chasing your bliss. Yeah, yeah. this is the new I chase your a, bliss. I hope I find a gargoyle in Seattle. Yeah, yeah. If we make it a priority. We'll do it. We can I find think, a gargoyle. It can't be that have at hard. At least one gargoyle. It, it in can't Seattle. be that hard. <laughs> I'm gonna look for like gargoyle for sale, Seattle. I almost said in the entire state of Seattle, they must have at least <laughs> one gargoyle. Yeah. <laughs> oh, we found myself, a cat. But then I said, you know what? Pe the people deserve to know. Oh my God, how, Karina! How stupid my what? brain is. I found, I found him, on Wayfair. Mm -hmm. Oh no! Who's He's him? Socrates, the gargoyle thinker statue design. Is he cheaper on Wayfair? How much was he on Amazon? It's like two hundred thirty. This is two twenty six. Oh shit! Oh, we're going down. down. Oh my god! This one looks like Shrek with very long arms. I love gargoyles. I would love to have one <laughs> one day, but I will not be buying mass produced silliness. <laughs> when um, when this stream goes live. Uh, for the general public, I bet we're going to see a, a, a little boost in gargoyle sales across yeah. the board. Yeah, a tiny blip <laughs> on the graph. A <gasps> little bit of viral marketing for gargoyles. Yeah. All later. right. I'm sorry. I found a place that we have to go to now. Okay. Put it on the list. Put it on the dock. It's called Gargoyles Statuary. It's in Seattle. Okay. And they got gargoyles. And they got I mean, gargoyles. Like, with a you name know, like gargoyle statuary, you they better know have I gargoyles. wanna put yeah. it on the dock. <laughs> they have a section called Beyond the Iron Gates. Yo. Bro. <laughs> Gonna walk in, be like Octopus I wanna, coffee mug. I want a gargoyle, but it has to be one that I can bring back with me. <laughs> <laughs> they have a bunch of cat toys. They have a bunch of ones that are just corvids. Julia, we have to go. Cuddly creatures. This one's barfing. Oh, oh, yeah. <laughs> Julia's just off we doing her own shit again. We can't see what you're looking at. <laughs> so it doesn't matter. I, the, this, this Bahamut was very sounds... cute. That is cute. That's I Baphomet. See. I want to see Baphomet. Not Bahamut from Final Fantasy. <laughs> Bahamut. That's from the dragon Final from Final Fantasy. <laughs> Baphomet's the goat. It's a summon. <laughs> Don't worry about it. But yeah, we, go, we got to go check this place out. Baphomet yeah, is, is add the that goat. to the list. Goated with the sauce. Get a Porsche. Firecrow said you guys could vlog and put it on Droppy Extra. Mm. Here's us looking directly into the camera at you. Yeah. Tapping our heads. And, and and knowingly winking. We could do that. Oh, Porf's right in that. there. Yeah. Porf's it's right safe in there. there. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Porf oh, my goes. God. We can schedule an appointment to go. What do you mean an appointment? Well, because it says 20 to 30 minute time limits. Private appointments are available to 
for those at higher risk or would rather shop alone. That's oh, very sweet. Oh, very cool. That is Should nice. We, I have to reposition him yeah. so you can still see the butt cheek. A conscientious gargoyle statuary. I could buy a, a, a Baphomet in peace. Yeah. Yeah. That's without really nice. risk of COVID. That's awesome. Hell That's really yeah. Cool. Yeah, Hell we yeah. have to go there. I want to go there. Let's go put, to Put the it on the list. Put it on the list, please. Oh, I'm so excited. It'll be I'm so excited. Can you hide it? You could try, but... <laughs> no. Yeah. If you I were... want to say that if there's an uptick in sales of this gargoyle because I drew it and featured it on this stream, I demand they send me one. <laughs> That's only I'm fair. Just saying. It's only fair. Yeah. Yeah. I'm an influencer. Yeah. If, yeah. If one of the if they sell one that they wouldn't have otherwise sold, that's basically you you buying it. So yeah. they should just send you one. Yeah. Yeah. Anything more than that is just is just gravy. Yeah, you're welcome. Uh, hit me up. Email me. This is wonderful. I love him. Oh, our stream's like done, huh? Yeah, our stream's yeah, done. Yeah, we did it. Yeah, we, we got we poor, did start a little late. Poor so. looks so happy. I wouldn't <laughs> the happiest you be? he's wouldn't ever you been. Be? Yeah, poor foe's in, in his happy place. Yeah. <laughs> Just um, crammed right in there. Oh my gosh. Some some <laughs> things. So Monday we are streaming. Mm -hmm. uh, yes. Tuesday we are leaving for Seattle. Uh, which means that the following Monday we will not be streaming on Drawfee. Right. But then that week that we come back will be draw class. Jacob will be teaching uh, you about some mm -hmm. tips and tricks about running a YouTube channel. Yeah, Mr. Beast oh. over here. I'm gonna give you all my just you just have yeah. to sign up for my ninja master ninja class. Blue hair master class. Yeah. And I will teach you all I know about making a successful YouTube channel. Yes. Yeah, you sign up and if you can get um, two more people to sign up, then uh, you get Ex excellent status. Yeah, then I then I teach class. another class where I give you the real secrets. Yeah. yeah, yeah, not the fake ones that he was originally going. Jacob's tips and tricks in the in the first class is going to be like, um, you should uh start a channel. Whoa, that that's I it. Mean, to be honest, that is a pretty good yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you do need to do well, that how that's do crucial I do that? what's a computer <laughs> um but otherwise uh if you are going to one of our three seattle shows we're excited to to meet you there we're very excited to do these shows we'll be selling yeah. some some merch and doing a meet and greet after the show but most importantly throughout the whole show while you're in the theater at at, at any time you have to wear your mask Gotta the entire mask. time Gotta got keep it, it on. Gotta keep be, it on over your nose reminders. and mouth. Yes, we yeah. will. Jacob's making some reminders. Grim the, reminders. The theater is also going to be reminding people and enforcing it. But uh, yeah, we're really excited to see you guys. Yeah. If we if we spot anyone without their mask on for just a little too long, we will bully you. I will. Yeah. Oh, don't well, threaten people with that. Some people would be into that. Well, we won't bully you, but um our associates will make you leave silently yeah 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 you won't see a, a silent bully yeah. yeah uh but that's it we're excited to see you in seattle uh otherwise we'll see everyone here in like two weeks yeah in draw class yeah and monday yeah. Yeah. yeah and we still have episodes coming we, out oh, we got it oh man <laughs> oh yeah oh, oh baby next, next week we've got one of our nastiest episodes coming out i'm very excited oh, oh i, I can't don't. wait i'm so excited i don't know what that is all right oh, you you weren't even there for that yeah one. that's yeah. why it was so nasty. i was about to say that's why it was so nasty <laughs> you know how it is bye everybody bye, bye. bye. That's over and then